Don't worry about getting even when you already beat the odds. If God allowed you to break through and not break down, he has something meaningful, meaningful for you. But I need you to understand this here. You heal not to get even. You heal to get better. You don't get bitter, you get better. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a reset, a self-care motivational kind of video as well. So as you see guys, today's like a slow morning for me. I am not going to the gym, but even though I'm not going to the gym, I still wake up pretty early. I got up at 5.30 so I could speak to my son, get him up for school, and then right after that I went into listening to a worship song and then I was reading my Bible plan while I was listening to this song. After this, I decided just to like lay a little bit, like spend like an extra hour laying down. I don't know, even when I try to sleep in, it doesn't really work for me because my mind is already up. My body is so used to being up. And right here, I'm just like stretching, I'm getting my life together. into some hygiene stuff like this morning i'm in no rush today is my rest day from the gym so i was just taking things real slow okay i am literally picking out all my hygiene products um to brush my teeth i use this toothbrush it's it's by sonicare philip sonicare um this is like a newer one for me i had one before and then it stopped working um after having it for like two years so i upgraded this toothbrush comes with like an app tells you how long to brush your teeth what to do it was a little on the pricey side but i mean it's totally worth it but i'm flossing using my tongue scraper and i'm doing my oral hygiene i'm using this therabreath i really like this um oral brands it's like really really good so i'm just doing that and getting the mouth fresh and what i love about this app is like did you clean your tongue did you floss like it's just so cool and i don't know i just find it very motivational and now i'm just like washing my face i'm literally using um this cleanser that i got from target is a drugstore cleanser um very basic but it gets the job done my skin i realized like when i use too much things my skin doesn't react well i have to do like the bare minimum kind of I have to keep it basic i usually use ole henriksen but i was out of those products so whenever i don't have those i use my CeraVe. hopefully i said that right and i'm just adding some moisturizer and you know getting my skin prepped for the day getting Paxson ready for his walk. After I take him for like his walk and stuff and to go potty, I go to the mailbox. So I went to the mailbox, got my mail, and then now I'm just like cleaning him up. I usually do this once we get inside. I wipe his bum and I wipe his paws because I do have white furniture and you know, 
I don't want him to bring dirt or to just like wipe uh, stuff all over the floor. So I try to clean him. Honestly, you guys, this morning, um, when I the morning when I was doing this video, I was just not feeling good from the night before. Like I went to bed and I was not in the best space. So I decided when I got up this morning, I'm going to just like make the best of the day and turn like my mood around. Um, I went to church that Sunday and I just didn't feel like cleaning. I just wasn't feeling it that weekend. So I did no reset. So this is like my Sunday reset um, in Tuesday, basically. And I'm just like making my bed. You see me make my bed a lot of times, so I didn't like do it in detail. But I'm just making my bed. I really was trying to reset like everything. And I didn't do like washing my sheets in this specific video because I had washed them Sunday when I had come from church. That was the only thing that I did sun that Sunday, well before Tuesday. Um, so now I'm just doing what I should have done to start the week on Tuesday, but that's okay. So we're finally back home and I'm just trying to figure out my next move. I knew I needed to clean and reset the house, but I didn't have a plan as to what time I'm going to do this or whatever. I was just going with, with it. I was really just going with it and I just did what I know I needed to do and just fit it where it best. guys these juices from trader joe's they're so good they're green smoothie and they're mango smoothie definitely try it and i forgot the coffee that i was showing you guys their nitrogen cold brew is so good i tried it like the other day just because i wanted to see what see you know sometimes you see stuff there and you just want to try them so i bought it and i tried it and i loved it so that day i got myself like you know two more so i could have it for my coffee 
and to just like get me through the day and that oat creamer is pretty good it was my first time trying it in this video I like it it's very light I realize I have a low tolerance to anything that has milk so I've just been trying a lot of like um, oat products instead of anything that's like milk related You know, look at my flowers in the window. I don't know, I feel like it just looks so dreamy. So I added it to the window. Now it's finally time to get to this cleaning because I should have been done this cleaning. And y'all, this shower speaker, I got it on Amazon. It was like 20 some dollars, girl. It's so good. I use it every time. And I was just listening to some Afro beats. I changed my clothes. I put like an old like tank top on that I didn't really care about and like some tights that I really didn't care about. And y'all, when I clean my showers, I use the Dawn dish soap and that's it. Like before, I used to use a lot of products and then my cousin was just like, you don't need all that product. You can literally just like run the shower, allow it to like steam up and then use like the Dawn and scrub the glass, like scrub the glass with like a sponge and then you rinse and then you just dry with paper towel and it's super clean guys it really worked so i've been using way less product like dawn dish soap or just like dish soap overall it can do so much like you can use it to clean a lot of things I don't know about you but like cleaning helps me to relieve like it helps me to release energy and it makes me less like stressed like less anxious like it does something for me I don't know <laughs> maybe I'm weird but once I get in a mood I just start to clean and that's a great stress like release for me let me know down below if y'all feel the same way because I really be cleaning, okay? And for the outside of my um, shower, I just use a little Windex just to shine the outside glass. And I'm just listening to my Afrobeats guys and just jamming. I don't know what's in that coffee, but it made me so hyped. Like it made me so energetic. And now that like our shower is clean, we're gonna do the toilet. And guys, if you've never tried these Clorox, um, oh my God, that's the dancing for me. I'd be dancing and I, I'm not like a dancer, but I, I just like to feel the music and just like, and enjoy myself I enjoy myself by myself and I, I love that I love my alone time but anyways these cleaners are from Clorox they're disposable you can use them to clean your bowls and every time you use one you just toss it I'm just like cleaning my sink. I'm removing everything so I can thoroughly clean the sink. And guys, deep cleaning and resetting like this helps me to flow when my space is upside down and just not clean and things are out of place it 
adds to everything that's around me if that makes sense so once everything is just like clean and tidy and together i feel like i'm able to have like a better week i'm able to be more productive And I'm just like swiffering my room. I swiffered the bathroom. So like that side of the house is clean. And I like to work section by section. So one side is done. Then I can like move on to something else versus just working all over the place. Then there's a living room, which was just like, it was like a lot going on. And I did clean the other bathroom. I think this clip is afterwards because my camera had died. So I had went ahead and just like tidied this bathroom real quickly. So then I think that was what I was showing you guys. And now uh, this is a living room. So we're going to just have to pick everything up. But wait, we have to have a lunch break because girl, if I ain't got food in my system, it's just like, okay, we can't function. So I had a little lunch break. Um, and kind of had a little phone break too. I, was, I think I was checking my messages and stuff. And before I start doing anything, I like to, um, <laughs> you see that in my face? Oh my God. I, I, Cause I'm like, wait, what's going on in here? I just like to find all the odd objects that are just like not in the right place and I pick those up first. Once I put all the odd stuff in the place that they're supposed to be, everything starts to make a little more sense, okay? So that's what I do and then it gets easier. Just cleaning the sink I love to like scrub the sink down after I wash like a lot of dishes and stuff I don't know if everyone cleans their sink but I think you should <laughs> like seriously but I really be scrubbing the sink and then just like rinsing so I know that it's like clean and there's no like food left over or anything to lead to like smells in the house And then guys, I had to go outside to take packs and to use the bathroom. So I had to, um, I put a shirt on. So now I was back. I'm cleaning the stove. Having a glass top stove is so annoying. I really like, 
I need to get me a gas oven, like a gas stove for my next place because the glass top stove just drives me absolutely nuts. But I use the Wayman glass top cleaner. It's a kit. It comes with that scraper thingy that I'm using and also the scrub to clean it. Um, look at how nice wow look at how nice it comes out after you use all the tools but it is a lifesaver and i'll put it in the description box for you guys in case you know you have a glass top stove but using that is really a game changer for how clean and shiny the stove is and i'm just wiping out all the appliances you know stainless steel so all the fingerprints and stuff be on there so i'm just trying to get rid of that trying to like you know finish up um and vacuum in the kitchen and with my chairs guys you're gonna see me switch them out because usually i sit on the same exact chair in the same spot every time i eat so i try to like shuffle them around move them around so i don't always sit on the same chair if that makes sense because if you keep sitting on the same one it's gonna be worn and in the others are gonna look like you know brand new and it's just gonna be weird if the, i don't know if that makes sense but that's like my thought <laughs> process so i'm just like switching them around using my lint roller to pick up anything that's on there and guys these chairs they've held up really well and also my sofa i have to say they've held up pretty well everything is pretty clean it doesn't look worn or torn so i love that and i'm just like picking out the garbage and i'm wiping down my trash can where you're gonna see that I tend to wipe the trash can down, the insides, the outsides, and just around the rim. Like, even though the bags are in it and it's lined, stuff still gets, you know, on the can. So I feel like it's important to like clean your trash can. I am in my office just like setting up this outfit because I had really wanted to film that outfit and I didn't end up filming it but anyways that was what I was doing I was setting up for Wednesday because I had wanted to record and I was showing y'all this bag that I got from Amazon it was supposed to match it was supposed to go with the jacket it did not go baby so I was just putting it up to send it back and then I'm just cleaning my desk taking off everything that's not supposed to be there like why do i have eyelashes on my dicks like like everything that's not supposed to be there i'm just taking them off putting them back in their rightful place and then just clearing everything up and just making everything flow and be more together so when i get up the next day and go into office it'll make sense i won't want to like turn back and not be in there i have to like create a organized and clean environment just so i'm able to thrive if that makes sense i have to set myself up for success guys because when things is all over the place like i don't want to do anything i'm over it like 
when it's more organized and together like okay we're ready we can do this and i'm just like dusting everything down and just yeah getting ready um for the most part i think we are done cleaning i think yeah finally done cleaning yeah okay because i'm lighting a candle so that means we done overview of everything the sun was like shifting to set so i was just trying to get you you know the vibe the apartment is clean i feel so good there's nothing better than a clean apartment wow fresh flowers like i felt so good at the end of this day compared to how i had started it and that's just like it goes to show that you are the author of your life and you can literally turn anything around it's just dependent on your perspective and then it's me and Paxson going outside I wanted to watch like the sunset even though it was like a reset I was trying to do self-care and just do little things to make me feel so much better to like put me in a better mind space for the rest of the week It's finally like me time like I spent the whole day cleaning I was itching to go in the shower so that's what we're gonna do right now baby we're gonna do that right now I did not know the day would have um, went by so quickly and because I was doing so much I wasn't able to stop and take my shower from like in the day because that was what my plan was and then I would take a bath once i was going to bed because i wanted to unwind but baby we're gonna do the shower and the bath all together so i'm just setting up my waxer because i needed to wax my armpits and i'm just lighting a candle setting the mood like i literally set my apartment up in the evening like i set it up for the for like an unwind kind of mood i change i change like what's going on in the background i control like the sounds that i hear the light just like everything and i'm just taking my shower i was so happy to be in the shower and i was trying to like show y'all what i was doing but i didn't know it was gonna fog up like this like i'm like well what is going on and i was already in the shower i couldn't really do anything and then my camera was dying so i'm just like you know what okay cool if y'all want a shower routine like comment down below that y'all want one so i can make like a video like a complete video that's just about that because today was a day okay baby this was a, this was a day and so there ain't no shower routine but i'm using um the raw sugar soap and i'm just using these exfoliating gloves <laughs> i'm so silly these exfoliating gloves to really scrub my body and then i had gone and shaved my legs i was trying to show y'all then my battery died and i was in a shower so that was that and then i came out and i waxed my underarms because I needed to go to the gym in the morning and I needed you know to take care of my hygiene stuff I don't I don't like having like my underarms with like you know fuzzies so I waxed my underarms and we went to the other bathroom so I could do a bath
I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please feel free to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Let me know if you want more videos like this. Bye. <laughs>